Hey you guys, what's up? Um, hopefully you were able to see that, um, I guess drive around my neighborhood early in the morning. Uh, that was a drive just in the main area to show you that that was at 6.30 in the morning, okay? So at 6.30 in the morning on a traditional middle of the week day, um, I would say not everyone is still home, but majority of the individual, let's just say 90% of the people was home and 10% already went to work. That's how crowded it was. It wasn't crowded. Now, um, there were two streets, like I said, that was pretty crowded. And I showed you where it was crowded. So, you know, that's the tough part of this whole situation. Um, during the board meeting, there were a couple individuals that promoted that the additional charges are fine. And, and you know what? I'm not challenging them. I do agree with them that there should be a charge when there's additional vehicles. One of the individuals uh, highlighted that, oh, it might should even go down to three cars. Seriously? In an ever-growing, you know, environment, you want three cars. Um, that's just not the ways of the world. If anything, everything's getting bigger. Now, I'm not saying this wrong. I'm just trying to promote a different, uh, different view per se. Um, so it's challenging. I want to make sure that it's clear out there. I'm not advocating to eliminate the rule. That's not it. What I am asking for is a revise and revisit, maybe on a case by case basis, case by case basis, to assess is it appropriate to charge, start charging on that vehicle. Six vehicle, no doubts. At that juncture, do it. But because of the size of our home and the lack of congestion, for say, in our community, having that grace fifth one at a subjective review I, I I don't believe that that's a not rational type of, of, of assessment look I'm not trying to form an A and B side that's that's not my goal but it is my goal to be fair and very factual about things these things I'm saying it is factual that I've shown you visual confirmation of that we are not at the capacity that what has been some individuals has promoted it's just it's just we're not busting you know through the seams in regards to to cut the capacity of vehicles in our in our neighborhood certain streets are highly are higher with regards to volume but there are still parking spaces. Don't, don't, that's, that's not, that's not a, an accurate depiction. So consider it. That's, that's really all I'm asking, not to eliminate it. That, that's really what I'm asking. And for those individuals that continues to advocate that possibly less, come on. I mean, it, Watch the video. Watch the, 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 the drive through drive by again. You know, I'm confident you might want to rebuttal and take pictures of how congested, whatever it is. That was at that was at 6:30 a.m. on a normal weekday. Is you know they're home. If if they're going to be home, they're home. I'm not even doing evening because at times they could be out for dinner and so forth. They are home majority of the people are still at home in the morning so anyways um as usual please subscribe i really appreciate all you guys are starting to just really helping me piling up my views i really appreciate that I, I, you know consensus shows that you know my, my videos are getting views which i really appreciate but do subscribe i need subscribers i want subscribers and um till then peace out and enjoy until the next one
Thank you.